Hey, what's good? It's your boy, Matthew Michael. And in today's video, we're going to be talking about how to make money selling in the money calls. In today's video, I expect to be making well over $400 selling calls in this video. Hey, so be sure to watch the end to see how I plan on doing it. But before we get into the video, please be sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification icon so that you don't miss any future content or giveaways. It would also really help me out in reaching my goal of having over 100,000 subscribers by the end of 2022. Also, while you're down there, be sure to smash the like button. It really helps to push these videos out to those who need it and also really helps to support the channel. And one more shameless plug, if you're interested in joining my Discord community where I give out all my challenge plays as well as anything that I think will actually be something, hey, be sure to check out the referral link down below in the description. And without further ado, let's get into the video. All right, so here we are in my Thinkorswim account and what we're gonna be focusing on right here is uh, yet again, we are going to be focusing in on Lucid and how I grow this portfolio without really putting any of my own money in it. This is my Roth IRA and at, at the moment I'm growing other accounts. While I probably should be putting all my money here or at least maxing it out every month, at the moment I can't really do that. So um, I have to grow it by other means. But uh, one, of the, one of the ways that I have been doing that is selling calls and the only stock I have that I can really sell calls on at the moment is Lucid. So whenever I see the opportunity, I really like to hop on it. So right now today, um, I just sold this at a Friday, January 7th, the first Friday of the year. I saw this opportunity, Lucid went up actually. Looks like it may be a short squeeze, something like that. But anyways, Lucid going up real quick and it looks like it's about to reverse. So uh, kind of what we have going here, I sold an in the money call uh, if we look at Lucid, Lucid is actually trading at, it's in that 41.70 range. When I sold this, it was at like $43 and some change. But um, basically I sold a call $3 in the money because I believe that whenever this contract expires, it'll actually be out of the money or maybe just a little bit in the money. And if it is, I'll still profit just because um, I sold it for $425 and it fits at $41 when it expires. I still made about $325, so not a bad play. I've done this before in this account. I actually did it early on this channel. I think I made about $705 off the position. If I make the max profit on both of these, that'll lower my cost on these by a total of about $1,200 including the 700 the first time and the 425 the second time. So maybe more about 1230. Just wanna quickly go over my average cost basis. Um, my average cost basis on these is $3,100. And if this trade goes through, um, including that first trade, my overall cost basis on this will be $1,900 for these 100 shares of Lucid. So right now I'm working on trying to make all these shares free, but um, Going on, uh, let me further explain this play to you. The reason I'm able to sell a call on this is because I own 100 shares of Lucid and this is something I hope to be able to do till the end of time. Uh, I expect Lucid to go a lot higher. So this is definitely a stock I wanna continue to hold on to. But when I see opportunities like this, I really like to take advantage of it, sell and make some money off of it. Cause again, I'm not depositing my own money in here. All right, so um, right now, Lily made this play less than less than 20 minutes ago and i am up 102 dollars on it uh as long as lucid expires below 40 dollars i made a free 425 dollars and i get to keep all my shares if this contract next friday expires above 40 dollars for any reason the person on the other end has the right to buy my 100 shares for 40 dollars so say it expires at 41 dollars i still get to sell them 100 shares for $40. So that's $4,000 right there. And then on top, I still have my $425. And if I want to buy back in, I just buy the stock for $41. And then I still have an excess $325 profit. So yeah, this isn't something that I do every week just because um, I want to hang on to these shares. I don't want to sell it, but just the way it moves and how fast it went up like if we look at it um it's actually up just under 10 percent on a day it was actually up like 13 percent when i sold it and that's very unusual for lucid there's not really a catalyst so again it looks like that was a short squeeze of some sort going on in the market so that is kind of what's going on here 
Uh, that is kind of why I did it. And should it seem like, hey, maybe this isn't going to expire where I want it to, or it's not going in my favor, I can always buy it back. Like if I wanted to buy this back right now, I could buy it back. I'd be paying $340 and I would still keep $85 of the $425 that I sold this for. All right, and quickly before we get off the computer right here, I wanna show you where I actually found this inspiration. This website right here is called Tiblio. Um, they have all these different screeners. Like you see they have credit spreads, uh, naked puts, bull squeezes, um, all this stuff I will go over in the future on my channel. But um, what I'm looking at right now is cover calls. So I saw this opportunity and you can sort these by however you want. Uh, you can sort it by symbol. That's how I had it sorted. You could sort it by whether it's puts or call, expirations, the strike price. But uh, basically what I did, I didn't pick the exact play from here. But I really came here for inspiration. So I sorted it by the symbol. I then came down, I think it was on like page six. I did have to go over a few pages because it's alphabetized and it just gives you so many options. I specifically like jumped ahead to another page because I wanted to do it on something I had. I didn't want to do it on something I had to buy. So, but yeah, I had to keep going until I saw the page that had the L's. As you can see, they have so many options, but yeah, you see they have uh, all these sell call plays for Lucid. Like this one would be, I could sell a call, a $46 call on Lucid um, for next week. I actually could have made more money. This one actually would have been a little bit safer. I'm a little bit more risk on. Uh, and I was okay with it. So basically what I was thinking when I did, I was like, I like this play right here. So I took the inspiration date, but I kind of looked at the option chain myself and, you know, picked my own strike price. Now going back to the portfolio, again, Lucid looks like it's trying to go back up. Be sure to subscribe and turn on your bell notification icon so that you don't miss any future content. Uh, so you can see whenever I actually close out of this position. And if you're interested in Tiblio, seeing more videos, a hey, comment down below in the description, or if you want to just try it out for yourself, uh, I actually have a referral link down below in the description. And when you sign up, it really helps the channel out. Um, and when you sign up, you get 50% off your first month. Uh, it's paid on a monthly basis. I think it's like $35 a month for Tiblio. And so you begin the first month of all those plays, all those screeners, and they even have a cool little trade journal. Like, let me show you real quick. It's awesome. All right, so where's that? All right, so trade journal. I need to update mine for 2021. Uh, this one's actually for some time ago. I hadn't used it for a bit, but I want to refresh it and make mine look better. It shows like your winning averages. It shows like your P&L on each of your positions and trades you make. And you know, kind of my average profit per trade. This was from a different account, of course. But um, yeah, love this little trade journal. Uh, you can log all your trades and it's it's awesome. But anyways, again, if you're interested in joining my Discord or Tiblio, hey, there, there are gonna be links down below in the description. If you're interested in any free stocks, hey, yo, check out the Moo Moo link, the Weeble link. Check out, basically, if you like free stuff, go down to the description and check all that out. If you made it this far and haven't already, please be sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification icon so that you don't miss any future content or giveaways. And also, I do have a goal of hitting 100,000 subscribers by the end of the year. So if you did subscribe, really be helping me get a lot closer to that. And also while you're down there, hey, please be sure to smash the like button. It really helps to support the channel and push these videos out to those who could really benefit from it. And last but certainly not least, thank you so much for watching and peace.